Hi everyone, this is Pamela and welcome to my channel. So continuing with the Look Within series, uh, we are going to talk about or address the victim mentality. These people that somehow you might know that it's always blaming the others for their issues that cause themselves, but they are not able to look at themselves and that they are the one who need to change. And that's why they keep repeating the same stories. It's just that they change the character of the people who is surrounding these same issues over and over again. So that's why it's so important to take the time to always observe yourself and try to look which are these things that you keep doing that doesn't allow you to grow as a person and improve your personal relationships. So how to recognize that you have a victim mentality. Recognizing a victim mentality involves being aware of certain thought patterns and behaviors. Here are some signs that might indicate a victim mentality. Number one, constant blaming. You frequently blame others for your problems or circumstances. Number two, feeling powerless. You often feel that you have no control over your life or the events that happen to you. Number three, negative outlook. You tend to focus on negative aspects and assume the worst outcomes. Number four, self-pity. You often feel sorry for yourself and dwell on your misfortune. Stop doing that. Number five, reluctant to take responsibility. You avoid taking responsibility for your actions and their consequences. Number six, clean. You frequently complain about your life and feel that nothing for you. Number seven, comparing yourself to others. You often compare your situation to others and feel that they have it better than you. Number eight, lack of initiative. You might feel unmotivated to take changes or take actions to improve your situation. So it is very important to always pay attention of those traits if you are definitely having these characteristics this to start changing if you notice several of these signs in yourself it might be helpful to reflect on your mindset and consider seeking ways to shift towards a more empowered perspective this can involve self-awareness recognizing and acknowledging your thought patterns taking responsibility accepting responsibility for your actions and decisions setting goals, establishing and working towards personal goals, positive thinking, focusing on positive aspects and practicing gratitude, and last, seeking support, talking to a therapist or counselor to work through these feelings. It is important to be kind to yourself during this process and understand that changing a mindset takes time and effort. So if you like the video, but the most important part, it was very useful for you, I would like you to subscribe to my channel, to give me a like, and especially to share it to somebody that you might think that actually need this. So as I always say, I do this with all my heart, and see you the next time. Bye-bye.